Kern. He's live with our mobile weather lab at a popular place this time of year, the Salt Pile in West Town, Ed. Look at this pile of salt behind me here. I'll tell you what, it is breezy out here, as Steve warned about. It. We're having gusts up to 20 miles an hour, but our temperature's not too bad. We're right at about 49 degrees, but it will get colder. It will get snowier. Today, the city got together all the agencies and the press for a winter weather workshop. Chicago's Office of Emergency Management brings all the players together, like the National Weather Service. Probably a more active weather pattern. Streets and sand with tracking tablets being tested in more than a dozen snow plows. It's going to be turn by turn to where um, it'll help the driver uh, navigate them. The city has 374,000 tons of salt, 19 new spreaders, and quicker salt loading capabilities. The city of Chicago has purchased 14 new high lifts, which uh, we'll be using at our salt piles that will help us uh, load out our salt, um, which will help us in the long run getting salt into the truck so we can get those spreaders out on the street. Chicago's ready for whatever winter wallops us with, like the 8-inch Friday forecast in 2015 that became a 19-inch Super Bowl Sunday touchdown. The city tackled it. Whatever comes our way, we believe we have a good plan in place and believe that the city of Chicago is prepared uh, for what's to come. So where is all that salt? There's one pile behind me. There are 18 more around the city. A Grand and Rockwell, Ed Curran, CBS 2 News. Rob and Erica. We are prepared, it sounds like. All right. Thank you, Ed. Well,